Good morning, good afternoon, good evening guys, depending on where you are watching from here. Welcome back to my YouTube channel once again. In today's video, I'm going to be showing you guys how to first cross your stubborn rabbit. So today I wanted to cross this rabbit, so I thought it twice to make a video for you guys. I tried crossing it before, but it was not receptive. So I, I want to show you guys how to do this in case maybe if your rabbit does not want to cross, any of your rabbit that is stubborn that does not want to cross, this is the easiest way to cross it. You just need your rubber band. You just need your rubber band. So if that is the mail I'll be using. Although that, that place is quite far. So you zoom it a bit. Maybe you get it from this angle. So just get your rubber band. Then put the rubber band around the rabbit's body like this. Just put it around the body. This rabbit is quite stubborn. Oh, that should... Aha. Just put it around the rabbit's body like this. And if you can see, the rubber band is on the waist of the rabbit. Just on the waist of the rabbit. Uh -huh. Then, just put it on the waist here. Then take it up like this. Get the tail. Bend it. Don't know if you are seeing what I'm doing. Pick it like this, get the tail of the rabbit, bend the rubber band, cross it like this, bend it again, then you leave it. So, the vagina is showing very well, it's showing very well. So, just pick the rabbit up, then you put it inside the cage of the male so i'll be i'll be assisting the male too i'll not allow it to just cross on its own i'll be assisting the male so when you just put it in you just use your hand to raise it up a bit use your hand to raise it up a bit as you can see it's successful now so you see the male has fallen off so you just take it out just take the female out then you just wait for like few minutes maybe three to five minutes before putting it out there are other ways to also first cross your rabbits but this is the easiest way sometimes you you just put the rubber band around the rabbit's waist like this as i just showed you i just put it in there it will cross but sometimes when the females are very stubborn if you just put it in there like that without assisting the male it will not accept to cross so that's why if I put it inside the cage, I like using my hand under the rabbit's stomach like this. I'll raise it up like this a bit for the male. So that as the vagina is showing very well, I'll just raise it up also. So it will be like the male, the female is raising up her, her butt up when they are on heat. That's just what I want it to be like. So I'll just raise it up a bit then the male will cross and you are good to go. So. Maybe you can just do it three times, four times. Some people say the more times you do, the higher litter you get. But I don't believe in all that. Sometimes you even cross your rabbit once and you get eight to ten liters. Sometimes you cross three times and you just get four liters. So I don't believe in all that. Just do as many times as you want. I like doing three times or four times, depending on the rabbit. Sometimes, like so for some of my rabbits, I even do two times. And they will still give birth very well. So, depending on what you want to do, is is for your own is your own choice. Do what works for you very well. Uh -huh. Do what works for you. I do three times. You can choose your own. I do three times or four times. You can choose your own way. And also, when you want to cross your rabbit, make sure you use a male that is very that is mature enough. A male that is up to eight to from eight months to a year old. That's when you, you can use a male so that you get a very good result. If you use a younger male, you might be getting little liters because your male is not mature. If you some people use male that are six months, it will cross and it will get successful. And the rabbit might even give birth. But you'll be having less litter or sometimes your since you are using small males, you'll be having small size of litter. But if you are using big males, big males to a very healthy female. You'll be having a very very uh, good result. Your your rabbits will, be, will come out very very good. Come out very very strong, and they'll be very very 
active. So let's just try once again. If if it work, let's just try once again. But I, I think it's not enough time for the male to rest. I just want to do the video not too long, so we should just try once again. Let's see if it work. She's struggling too much. That worked one one more time. I decided to pause the video so that the rabbit will at least rest a bit for like three to five minutes. You can also do that also when you want to cross. You just give the rabbit three to five minute interval. I don't like leaving my females inside the cage like that. Some people just put their females in there and leave it. I don't like leaving it there because they might end up fighting and one of them might get injured. So I don't like leaving it in there. I just cross three times, then I remove it. Uh -huh. So I want to try one more time again if it work. But even if it even if it uh, does not work, even if it does not work, it's still good. That two times is fine. If it, even if it does not work, that two times is fine. So let me just try one more time again if it work. The female is very very. Okay, it has worked one more time again. Hope you guys can see that. It has worked one more time again. So if you do find this video helpful, please do want to subscribe, turn on the notification bell, like, comment, and share. And if you are watching this video on Facebook, please do well to follow our Facebook page at African Rabbit Farmers. And I'll be dropping the link to our YouTube channel on the Facebook on this video. On Facebook, I'll be dropping the link on the comment section on Facebook. So for those of you guys who have not followed our YouTube channel, so you can follow, you can subscribe to our YouTube channel from there. I will be dropping the link on the comment section of this video on Facebook. And those of you on YouTube, do want to like this video so that YouTube will be showing this video to more people. And if you do like this video, just turn on the notification bell so that anytime I post a video like this, you will get notified by YouTube. Do have a nice day. Peace out.